Hey everyone, Pupsker here, and today, that's right, I, a Warframe content creator and player, shocking, have started playing Destiny 2 finally. In preparation and, you know, I guess hype of Lightfall release, I decided, hey, I'll pick up the game and start playing it, and I'll play through Lightfall whenever I can. So that means we're going to talk about the new player experience in Destiny 2 as I, a Warframe player, am very used to everyone saying in both Warframe, new player experience is terrible, and in Destiny, the entire time I was talking with chat about Warframe Destiny parallels, right, because everyone always yells about that. How terrible is the Destiny 2 new player experience? Is it better, worse than Warframe? Well, they're both like 7 to 10 year old type active service live service games so no shot that they're like great right no matter what the live service new player experience is gonna be a little rough and i myself am about four hours into destiny 2 i completed like the new whatever the new way the new light your first initial tutorial questing for the first yeah i guess unlock of everything okay i completed that I have my build set up, I guess, I have weapons, I can go do more quests, I have the uh, entire open world areas unlocked, the tower, what have you. So now I'm actually starting to unlock the game, and the new player experience is pretty much exactly what I expected it, it to be. The first four hours is literally tutorial quests to get you used to shooting your gun, using the navigation, the different systems, weapons, abilities in the game, and so far, like four hours in, doing the tutorial quest stuff, you just kind of like touch the surface in the like, uh, what is it, like Cosmodrome, whatever that area is called. Nah, doesn't really matter too much. We're gonna be all over the place in this, right? So the new player experience, it makes sense in Destiny 2. I feel like if you're not a huge player of looter shooters, it might be a bit much. Because, like, the, every quest is like, here's something new, here's how you do something. Uh, it just feels like you're running quests just to run quests for ages. And now that I've done the tutorial and the world's opened up to me, I have no idea where I, sh like, need to go or anything. There's stuff everywhere. It's, <laughs> it's like sensory overload. There's so many planets and different areas quests to do. They do have, though, the general, like, Guardian rank, uh, 1, 2, 3, 4, up to, so far, I think, Guardian rank 11 or 12, right? That's the general progression path of the game, and it is pretty simple, right? The progression path is play the game, do quests, do bounties, do raids, do dungeons, do strikes, just play through the game, get stuff done, and I'm okay with that. I think my general progression in the game is going to be playing Lightfall because that just came out and then I'll go back and play the story mode missions on release properly. But it's going to be a definite struggle. I am saying though Destiny 2 is pretty fun for new players, okay? I'm having a lot of fun. I instantly bought a ton of DLC though, so uh, I will be playing a lot of the story mode. And it's exactly what you'd expect. It's just messing you with just repeat quests that keep taking you through the same area so that you can get like new unlock or new ability or new quest augment mod right there's a lot of different screens in destiny okay there's so many screens in destiny 2 it's actually crazy so you just go from like menu to menu upgrading or like swapping things around so the entire first four hours is just playing the game and getting used to the menus, and uh, it's pretty funny. I'm getting used to it, getting used to the controls, it's not that bad, and we'll see how Lightfall goes, but... As of right now, I would say, Destiny 2 is fun, it's good for new players, but the new player experience, as always with any live service MMO type game, Sensory Overload. I'm used to it because I've played a ton of it, but for new players, yeah, there's just so much shit everywhere. I know how to like very quickly find out what path I want to go on for live service games, but other people might not. So there's just so much to do in the game. After I did the four hour tutorial or like three hour tutorial questing in the Cosmodrome, right? There's just so much to do. That's day one, my thoughts on Destiny 2, because I've only been playing a bit. I'm just going to have a handful of videos talking about it here and there, because it's, uh, it's what I'll be doing 
we'll see how that goes. We'll see how that goes. So, Destiny 2 is fun. New player experiences, overcrowded, there's stuff everywhere. But the first tutorial area made sense. It just, the new tutorial area sucks. Because it's like a reskin of Destiny 1 tutorial area. And you go around the Cosmodrone, I swear to God, like five to ten times over and over the exact same areas. Just killing enemies to run the quest and unlock more stuff. So, fun, but I can't wait to get more stuff. And uh, we'll truly see how annoying the new player experience is once I start playing more Destiny 2. It's just a little confusing and there's stuff everywhere. So it'll take a while to get used to it. But I get the idea of dailies, right? Season pass. And then story, quest, missions, and just missions in general. So I don't know how to progress properly. I'll just be doing stuff, trying to run Lightfall quests, and we'll see how that goes. Any tips are appreciated. Feel free. Check me out on Twitch, YouTube, streams, you know, everywhere. Because I'll be streaming a lot of this and just making occasional videos. So thank you, and I will see you all next time. Cheers.